Okay, people, I've tried recording this video three times. I am beyond over it. We are going to talk about SoFi. Pros, cons, do you need it? Yes, you do. Do you want it? Probably not, but you need it. So we're going to go forward into this. Okay, today we're talking about SoFi. Uh, SoFi is not your traditional banking account where you have a brick and mortar like you drive down the street to an ATM or not to an ATM. They do have ATMs. Uh, you drive down the street to like your local Wells Fargo or Bank of America. They're not going to be anything like that. Essentially, it's going to you're going to download their app, whether on your mobile device and or PC, and you'll set up a bank account through them. They are really awesome. They're currently doing a two hundred and fifty dollars sign on bonus. So if you are one of those people who like to churn cards and just make money for you know signing up for crap, this is perfect for you. I will leave a link in the description right under that subscribe button, button which you should hit on the way down. Okay, back into SoFi. Why do you actually need something like SoFi? In the US over the last couple of years, in inflation has ran a bit like crazy. Inflation increased 3.2% in July 23 from a year ago. And I believe the previous year before that it was four and the previous year before that it was closer to 5%. Uh, SoFi essentially is beating out inflation just by holding your money in the savings account instead of losing money to inflation. One of my favorite things to say, so you have $100, inflation is 3.2%, that $100 is now worth $97, which really sucks. Whereas SoFi, even on top of inflation, that $100 now becomes around a dollar and... A dollar 13 cents, I want to say. My math is not correct. Don't judge me. I am tired. I have been doing homework all day. Uh, okay, so some of the nice things about Safe, uh, SoFi. So SoFi does have their member rewards, which I think are really freaking awesome and really freaking cool. Get your money right, get rewarded. Uh, SoFi member rewards earn you points for making moves towards financial independence every step of the way. It's really nice. You sign up with your uh, just signing up for the card and setting up your bank account and going through all the steps, you can easily get around $25 just for setting up an account, which is amazing. Also, they have their $250 bonus, which is also really, really, really amazing. There are some downsides to that. I will get into that later on in the video. Okay, turn points into cash with SoFi's checking and saving. I have personally tested it. It is super simple right there in the app. You can easily earn an average of like $20 a month reoccurringly, which is really cool. You can put your points towards eligible loans. You can also convert your points into stocks, which is really cool. Also, you could use them for credit card statements, which like is super easy. Um, yeah, so that's one of my favorite things and why I think you should check out SoFi. Also, one nice thing about SoFi is you can get person personalized advice from a credit, uh, personalized advice from a financial planner. So say you're young and have a chunk of change. You don't know whether best way to do whether to save or invest it this is a great place and it's all really nice and in their simple interface within the app which yeah definitely at least check out the app download it sign up even if you don't put any money in it it's definitely worth it uh one of the downsides i will say of sofi is in order to get that 4.5 percent savings rate you must have a direct deposit so i do know some jobs which is kind of weird given in the modern age we are in that some jobs still will only do uh paper checks not direct deposit but if you do have direct deposit i would say go ahead and utilize this you can literally get one paycheck direct deposited into your bank account they do a if you get under 5,000 bucks direct deposited in a month, you'll get $50. If you do over 5,000 in a month, you'll get 250. I mean, free $250, never anything to complain about. I am definitely not. So one thing they do have is SoFi Plus. Usually when you come to a banking institution of this, of this sort, you must pay for their, you know, their plus thing. Well, nice thing about SoFi is their new premium memberships helps you earn more, save more, and access more. You can get SoFi Plus, no extra cost with direct deposit. So also, I'm not sponsored by SoFi, as you can tell by my subscriber count. I have met zero subscribers. Well, I have like 48. But so, like we said, the 4.5% on banking balances, and that is just for your savings. I believe you do get like a 0 0.05 for your checkings account, which is also nice. Also, if you have the plus, you get times two the points. So that $10 you could be making a week easily, reoccurringly, you could easily turn that to $20 a week. And 
yeah they're really awesome they're really nice some of the benefits on your banking balance you get 4.5 apy with the sofi plus three percent cash back on credit card purchases whereas with the normal sofi you only get the 1.2 and the two percent cash back times two earnings on every rule on all qualifying activities no overdraft fees up to two days earlier paycheck additional 0.25 rate discount on all loans because you can refinance your loans and jump through them not that i plan on it also with the sofi plus you get uh, you can get IPO allocations, financial planning, career coaching, member events, and event community crap. But this is SoFi. This is my video. I hope you like it. If you do not like it, give a thumbs up and like and subscribe. Catch me on the next one. And also comment what you guys would like to see next. Peace out and yeah.